Hey, this is John with Two Moose Home Inspections. Welcome to Inspector Insights. Today, we're gonna to be talking about water wells in a multi-part series. All right, we have a lot to cover whenever it comes to water wells. And one of the main things to understand is why is it that you might need a water well? If you don't have access to public water, then you need a water well. And so a water well is something that is drilled deep down on your property and it gives you access to water at your property. Now, sometimes there are communal wells where there is a large hole drilled or a large well drilled, and then that supplies water to an entire community. So we can either have a public water supply, we can have a small uh, community HOA type of water well, or we can have a private water well. But in general, they all work about the same. So let's talk a little bit about a water well and some things that you might need to know before we move into the next part. So the very first thing is that whenever you're looking at a water well, the thing that you probably have seen the most is this right here. So th this is the head. And so basically from here, we have electricity going in, we have water coming out. And if we look down a little bit further, we can see this line going across. And this, this line is basically our frost line. And so the thing to keep in mind about frost line is that in our area, the frost line that we have is basically set at about 48 inches. So 48 inches is where our frost line is at. And so anything that is above the 48 inches, so let's say you only buried it 30 inches, then that is going to freeze. And so we don't want our water to freeze. So anything that we do has to be below frost line. Now, the next thing to take a look at uh, is that whenever we get down to the, um, to the well, the actual pump is right here. And you can see that we have this blue line. And so here's this blue line right here. And what that blue line does is indicates that this is where the water table starts. And so again, all of this is just generalized, you know, brief overview, but this is where we have water for our well. And this is where we're going to start sucking that water up. So then what we're going to do is we are just going to take a look at the house. So in the house, we have a few things that we're gonna go over in much more detail. First is, whenever the water comes in, we have our pressure gauge, we have our switch, and then we want it to go over to a filter. Um, some houses, they might need to have some type of water storage solution, which we'll get into, or you might need to have a water softener, uh, and then eventually it comes to your tap. And so that is the general brief overview of what a water well is. And as you can see, we have a lot of things that we are going to discuss, a lot of things that we're gonna go over. And so um, in the next part, let's start diving into it.